So just recently we shot a railroad track which was super awesome hard and steel today we got a new piece of metal which is much lighter than steel but supposed to be just as hard if not harder than steel itself this is titanium smaller block but it's probably what inch and a half so we're going to be putting this up against a couple different rounds to see how bulletproof it is if it is just as hard or harder than steel we might need the armor piercing rounds again for today so stay tuned for that but let's just get started huge thanks to brady lockwood he is the one and his dad they are the ones who gave us this piece of metal to shoot at they were just as curious as we are starting out with the you know what it is 22 long rifle i wish the target was a little bit bigger but hey that just makes me practice my marksmanship. So, 22 long rifle, ready? Got that it. was a hit for sure. Okay, so it went and hit and absolutely nothing. You can barely even see like where it hits. Right there is where it hit. Just not even a scratch. Got to move up to something bigger. Nine millimeter full metal jacket out of the m &P shield. So it like barely, it nicked the side, did no damage at all. Absolutely no damage to the titanium with the nine millimeter. So now going on to bigger rifles. I do not think that the 223 is enough to do any damage. We will find out here soon. Ready? So it actually took a freaking huge chunk out of that titanium. Like again, hit on the side, but look at that. That's a good chunk. That was the 223, what's next? 762 by 39. My brother is behind the camera bragging that he can hit it first shot. So I'm gonna let you take the shot. If you miss though, everyone will know. Don't miss. Nailed Looks like it. you got it. <laughs> doesn't make any sense at all. What the heck? How is that a smaller hole than the 223? I don't understand what's going on right now, but the 762 left a smaller hole than the 223. 308 is much bigger bullet than the last two that we just shot. So here we go, ready? My GoPro! <laughs> so the screen looks fine. Oh God. The lens is completely busted. So that's what I don't understand what's going on right here. So the 223 has made the biggest hole out of all of them and that it shouldn't be that way. Okay, second shot with the 223 to figure out what the heck is going on because it should not be like that. Like it's just as big as the 308. It might be- It is a lot deeper. It might be a little bit deeper. I have no idea, but we have a clean, new, untouched side of this titanium. And you know what side this is for? The 50 cal. Let's whip out the 50 and see if it can go all the way through. Full metal jacket is what's coming up first. If the titanium block survives, we will go to the armor piercing. Like it might just break apart with the full metal jacket. So there might not be much left to shoot at. Nailed it. So it's in one piece still. Ready? I haven't looked at it. Oh, I barely nicked the side. Uh. But still, I don't think it would have gone through. So I think we need some armor piercing. Silver tip, API. Nailed it. Cooked it. Let's go check it out. Well guys, for some reason I'm off on my shooting and I like hitting the corners. That's one, that's my third corner that I've hit. So the API hit on the corner, completely blacked it out, the titanium. So honestly, we will never know because that was the last armor piercing round that I had. So next time I'll bring more, but I think that this titanium is actually pretty strong. It's a fun video. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time.